Alright guys, quick unboxing. G-Shock here. So this is the GM 2100B. I almost never buy used watches um, at all, let alone, you know, on, even on my Discord for my fellow watch enthusiasts. But my buddy Bobby Legs threw up this guy for sale and I had already done the video on the red one. You know, I missed out on buying the green and the blue one. Which, you know, they're going to become available again. Heck, I think Macy's just even had a super sale on these things where you could get them for like 150 bucks. Pretty sure I paid Bobby more than that for this one. So I'll probably lose my butt on this one. But here's the green one. And, oh man, I got to tell you, these things in person are way better looking than some of the pictures. And I'm sure some of the videos turning out really nice. But just like I knew that red was going to look really good, this green one looks amazing too. And I'm sure the blue one is the same case. So this one's killer. I'm digging it. Maybe a little more wearable than the red, but they're just not super legible. Whether it's the digital display or even the analog display, it's just not super visible. I will definitely be more excited when they come out with the metal ones and then they have um, a way more visible option here. Maybe some loomed indices. Come on, G-Shock. We're so close. You got rid of the metal keeper. Just keep going, man. We need the Loomed indices in a better, bold, easy to read dial layout. And if you're going to listen to everything I say, let's go ahead and throw a positive um, screen on there too instead of the negative screen. You know what? Email me. We can talk. I could probably give you um, a complete design. We like I'm. I don't even want anything for it. I just want to see the product. You're so close. These are awesome, but we can do better. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.